Hello everyone, Logan here. I don't like drama, I never have, and I didn't want to have to make anything related to this, but I just can't forget about it as it's not even the first time Candy Hans has done something like this. Just for those who don't know, Candy is a TF2 YouTuber who is most well known for causing drama and doing things like he's done to me. Throughout this video, all I want to do is inform the TF2 community about this person, not start a witch hunt. They're only 15 after all. That just wouldn't be fair. But I'm not going to leave anything out. Candy's threatened to dox me, and in quotes, ruin my life, um, tried to blackmail me, harass me in his own server which he invited me to, and that was after muting me so I couldn't even talk back. And last but not least, he made two alternate accounts to try and continue to harass me after I blocked him. Firstly, I just want to lay out the context here. So, about a year and a bit ago, Candy accused one of my friends of sexually harassing them online, which is a big accusation, of course, but I stayed out of it and let them resolve it, as they had some sort of online relationship. I don't really know the details, but, you know. But then, after that kind of died down a little, they joined my old trading server that I used to run, and stirred some trouble, so we banned them, and that was that. But on New Year's of 2023, while I was pulling an all-nighter, they contacted me, seeming surprisingly friendly. So I let my guard down, thinking that they had changed, since this was about a year ago, all of that other stuff happened. And after a few hours of talking, I joined the server. Then they muted me, and verbally harassed me for an hour or so, threatening to dox me and blackmail me with something I had said earlier. I stayed to collect screenshots, but I was banned, so I blocked them. But then they made an alternate account, where they tried to blackmail me again. Once I blocked that account, they then made another and tried to contact me through their friend once I had blocked that third account. I started talking to their friend who is understandably asked to remain anonymous, and they seem like a generally nice guy who has the unfortunate circumstances of being this guy's friend. After some more talking, that friend then added me and Candy to a group chat where they attacked me more, made things up, and sent screenshots of harmless messages that they claimed were the sexual harassment they were talking about earlier, and they showed me gore that people had sent him, I made my point, got some more screenshots, and left. Now the context is out of the way, this is just some screenshots I didn't include in that segment, including the thing that Candy tried to blackmail me with. But I outright said I put in this video anyway, since I couldn't care less. I'm not the only person who has had to deal with candy, unfortunately. People like RPG247A, BBQ220, and Vivian have some good videos compiling all of the vile things this depraved person has tried, including, but not limited to, sending NSFW content to minors, using slurs like the N-word as insults, racist remarks, empty threats, blackmailing, and using people's faces with that blackmailing and doxing. I'll leave a link to this playlist I've made compiling all of these videos if you're interested. Seriously, just searching up Candy Horns brings up drama before their own content. They thrive off this attention like a little narcissistic parasite. If you have something you want to share about the subject, please add me on Discord at ogalog hashtag AA65. If I do end up making an update, I'll be using things like DMs as more proof. This is just a list of everything Candy's done. I'm using more clown music because I think it's kind of fitting. 
Although this is obviously no joke. Verbally saying this now, just to be sure, don't go after Candy Hans. All I've made this video for is to warn the community both I have here and anyone who watches this in general to stay away from this vile creature. Don't join their server, don't DM them, don't comment on their videos, just don't contact them. Even after all this vile shit they've done, I don't want to encourage that cycle of hate, it'll just make things worse. To wrap this video up in a neat little hate-filled bag, my friend who will remain unnamed didn't sexually abuse this person. They've tried to claim the same thing about other people as well. Anything else Candy tries to say about me is lies. I've been 100% honest throughout this video with both Candy and myself. Now, this is a direct message to Candy, Horns, as I know for a fact you're watching this. As I've told you already, don't contact me again. Don't DM me in a year, don't go around making more alternate accounts, don't join my servers. Don't get your poor, poor friends involved. I don't care if you make a video attempting to defend yourself, go ahead. I just don't want to associate with any part of you. It was a mistake laying my guard down the first time, and that was a rough first 8 hours of 2023. I ideally would have liked to get this out earlier, but some very serious personal stuff has kind of prevented that, but I still had to make this. Sorry to everyone who didn't expect this, again, I don't enjoy drama, but expect more from me soon, this time TF2 related.